optical fiber and inject the battery. To the direction of handle switch cable. The connection should be based on channel A and B relativity. The two fiber sockets are separated with each other. There are two marks as A and B which must be relative to the fiber socket. Be careful about the fiber cable's direction to each socket. The same as the channel B. Now connect the power cable with the main console. This is the main control box of the injector. This is the optical fiber socket. Now we install the battery. Pay attention to the direction. Fix the screws. Also be more attention to the correct fiber socket channel. Connect the power cable. Attention to the warning tips for the distance of the box. Turn on the main control box. AC indicator means connecting with the net power, DC means battery. Turn on the main console. This is the host. Slow forward, fast forward, out fill, slow reverse, fast reverse. This is start, pause, and stop. This is a test. This is for the air bubble exhaust to confirm. Fast forward, backward button will keep working until you press stop. The two sides of the syringe are with different shape. There are also two different shapes for the socket on machine. Put it inside with a force, push it down and rotate it. Connect the J-type tube. Press fast forward make the piston to the end of the syringe. Submerging the contrast through the J-tube. Start the contrast absorption by pressing slow backward or auto fill on the machine. Connect the Y-tube with the syringes. Short one connect to the contrast and the longer one connect to the ceiling. Press the slow forward button, first exhaust the air bubble to the tube. Then exhaust bubbles for channel B. If air bubble exhausted, press comfort air bubble to make it ready. After that, the other buttons will be locked. Rotate the machine head towards the ground minus 45 degrees. This is the main console interface for injection. This is the current volume display of syringes. This is the delay time, pressure limit, 
range from 0 to 300 psi. Set the parameter here. Maximum volume is up to the current syringe size. This is the volume of syringe A and B. Total injection time KVO on or off. This is arm button, which means preparing injection. Save this protocol by save and can also customize this protocol's name. For example, we type in TOM. We can find the saved protocol in protocol interface. Recall the saved protocol by recall. Set all the system parameter on option interface, such as fast forward reverse rate, slow forward reverse rate, auto fill rate and volume, auto expire rate and test rate, test volume and KVO rate, pressure unit, screen brightness, high, middle and low. Test the syringe set A or B. After confirm all the parameters, we must press save. Default all the value by press default. Language setting. Safety instructions displayed on help interface. Manufacture information. Arrow troubleshooting for common error. Operation guide in case forgetting the steps. History for the operation log. To confirm all the parameters, press R. It will pop up one note to confirm the bubbles exhausted or not. Injector yellow button and the hand switch all means injection. For example, injection can be started by pressing the handle. If pulse required, press the handle again. Press continue or yellow button or handle to continue. Press stop or red button for emergency stop. During injection, the relative light will blink.